Not even COVID could keep a couple apart. In fact, it brought them closer together. This is who we're talking about right here. Sal and Marisa Soto survived the worst COVID symptoms together inside the same UMC hospital room. Nurses at the hospital were so moved by the couple's love, they temporarily named their room the honeymoon suite. They're back home now, and I asked them to look back on those days as well as what advice they have for couples. Yes, it made us stronger as a couple. That is how Maritza Soto describes her time with her husband and Cell inside the COVID unit at University Medical Center of El Paso. Yeah, she was my angel because she actually saved my life. That was she, she was together. She, she, you consider yourself both the catalyst and the lifesaver. <laughs> Not the lifesaver, I was a catalyst. And that is what Marisa called herself after she infected Sal with a dangerous virus. They contracted the virus before vaccines were available. I love you so much and I'm so sorry. I could have been the catalyst to your death and you didn't care. What was it like seeing your wife with all the tubing and all that? It was horrible. It was horrible. Uh, it was, it, looking at her is like looking at myself in the mirror. It, it just, mm -hmm. I mean, like she said, I didn't know if she was going to come out alive because she's got asthma. The Sotos have been married for 22 years, and they feel they've moved from their honeymoon suite at UMC to their honeymoon home in the city's east side. So I asked a couple whose love endured during the pandemic what advice they have for couples. I learned to be patient with him. And our advice to other couples, I mean, just understand each other, accept your flaws, love each other despite the flaws, because you're going to have flawed people. And if you keep waiting for that perfect person, you're never going to find them. He's perfect for me. I'm perfect for him. Maritza was a nurse at UMC when they were hospitalized. She retired shortly after the release from their honeymoon suite. COVID may not have taken a toll on their marriage, but it did take a toll on her career, caring for so many patients during the pandemic. So now who's your number one patient? My baby love. <laughs> her baby love is wearing that ring right there. Maritza's wearing that ring right there. Maritza and Sal take pride in the fact that they convince all of their family members to get vaccinated and boosted. But to this day, despite all the aches, pains, and difficulty breathing, they still look back at their stay inside the honeymoon suite with fondness because they spent it together. And they look fantastic. And they do. it's great to see a good update from what was a very trying time for them a couple of years ago.